What's up guys, Gamer Jim here playing Clash Royale. Today I want to go over the Master Mega Deck Challenge. Um, this is one of the coolest modes in this game by far, um, where you have to make a deck out of 18 cards. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over my deck, try to do it as quick as possible, and explain to you why this deck is literally just amazing. It, this, it just connects the synergy between this deck, it's just incredible. I'm literally 7-0 and, oh, and I've lost one tower. Um, so look, 10-0-0-2-1-2-0-1-0-1-0-1-0-3-0-3-1-3-0-1-0-1-0 and then this is a challenge. So I've lost only one tower in seven, eight matches actually if you include the tie. So let me just explain this deck a little bit. Um, obviously what I want to do is get a deck under four elixir so I can basically out cycle anybody. I have a ton of spells. I don't know why I'm playing with people that don't really use spells. I find it ridiculous. Um, I have the fireball. I have the barbarian barrel, the tornado, the poison, the zap, and the arrows. Basically, at any moment, I will have one to two of those spells, which really makes a huge difference. My win conditions, the golem, the P.E.K.K.A., uh, my air defense, baby dragon, witch, um, mega minion, and the flying machine. Obviously, um, a lot of air defense. I also have the splash damage with the witch and the baby dragon and the ice spirit if I need it. And I have an electro wizard for that uh, special legendary. I think it's the only legendary I have. Yeah, it's the only legendary, so all of you should be able to use this deck. Um, obviously, if you don't have the electro wizards, maybe use zappies. And then I have the one building, which is a furnace, just to kind of be annoying. Maybe draw out some poisons or something like that. Um, so this deck just works so, so well. Um, let's go right into battle. I can kind of explain um, what to do with the deck. Obviously, it's going to be kind of hard to explain perfectly because you're not going to have a match similar to mine when it comes to getting the cards. So right here, I'm going to go ahead and cycle the knight and just start placing cards. Um, don't want to push too hard, but a nice little cycle of the knight is pretty good. And I put the knight on purpose because he's kind of tanky. So, you know, he could almost be a uh, shield to my furnace I mean shield to you know my flying machine or any flying units that I need um, he can shield for him right here um, we should be doing pretty good right here I'm gonna take out my first spell put the poison uh, right here the mini P.E.K.K.A um, they put the uh, scar me so that shouldn't mess me up a little bit but we should still be good to go uh, I'm gonna go right here and the balloon I think it's one hit off um, doesn't even get a hit off. Uh, it'll get the explosion off. That's no big deal. I'm gonna go ahead and rush the baby dragon just because I know uh, he's really short on elixir. And he was able to pull off a mini P.E.K.K.A. I'm gonna go right here. That mini P.E.K.K.A. is not gonna get hit off either. Look at that. It doesn't even look like we're doing damage. The furnace is doing work on the right side. Tower is gonna be down to um, 1536 right here. I'm gonna go ahead and use the tornado. I don't know if he's gonna get the tower off yet. Yeah, it does. Oh my god, this is just perfect. Look at the furnace down to 1358 on that right side. And I feel like I have a really comfortable lead. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead with the golem. Valkyrie is actually gonna do work. This might be tower down, guys. It's kind of a shame because I've only lost one tower. Uh, but I think I might lose it here. Um, um, let's see. The golem's going in, the witch is doing work. Um, let's go with a fireball. Yeah, so that's gonna be oof. A lot of damage there, guys. A lot of damage there. But we gotta be kind of careful, guys. We don't have this lock in the bag at all. Um, those are gonna do work. Let's go ahead with an ice golem back here. Let's go ahead with the flying machine, and then I'm gonna go furnace on the right side. This push here on the left uh, should be good to go. Yeah, and I'm going to go ahead with the P.E.K.K.A. right off the bat. I know they have a Witch pretty close to Cycle. Um, they're not going to get it here. I'm going to go ahead with the arrows real quick as well. Oh my god, did you see that arrow value? That was insane. Right here, um, Fly Machine's going to do work as well. Let's go ahead with a um, Barbarian Barrel. And this would be really, really shameful if I lost. Considering I have so much damage dealt... I need to get this win, guys. This would be such a bad loss. Go here. Oh, and the Mega Minion is going to hit it off. going to get the hit off. Boom. There goes the Zap. Okay. 
um, the RG now with the mini P.E.K.K.A. I should be good to go. It's gonna get a couple hits off. Nothing too crazy. Flying Machine plus uh, Fire Spirits. That won't even get a hit off unless there's a freeze um, magically. And the freeze is not gonna happen. We're gonna go ahead with another Furnace. Um, now I was gonna go with the Poison, but I could just go with the uh, the Witch right here. And then what I'm gonna have to do, unfortunately, is I'm gonna have to go with the P.E.K.K.A. right here. Sacrifice the P.E.K.K.A. because the P.E.K.K.A. is gonna go down. Actually, no, it doesn't. Okay, so the P.E.K.K.A. doesn't go down. Um, they're gonna go right here. I'm gonna go with the poison. Um, Baby Dragon should take this out. Oh man, that was a really, really good giant skeleton. But it's a little too early. The oh my god, this is a crazy battle, guys. Let's go ahead here. That should take out the witch, uh, the wizard, whatever. My bad. And then I'm just cycling, cycling, cycling. Let's get all this back here. And then oh no, oh no, that 10 is gonna kill me. Let's use a zap right here. Let's use a right here. Let's go right here with the arrows. Look at my spells just doing work, guys. Let's go. Oh, oh my god, I misclicked. Oh, we just got it in time. This game is crazy, guys. Crazy. He's trying to play the RG. I feel like it's in cycle. I'm gonna go ahead right there. Yeah. Right there. Let's go with a um, let's go right here. Let's go right here. Let's put right here. Freeze all that. And then I think that's going to be... Oh, not it yet, guys. So, not it yet. I don't know if they have any spells, honestly. Um, I, I think could I win with a fireball? I think I can win with the fireball. Oh, my God. If I pull this off. If I pull this off. Oh, only tornado, tornado real quick. And then zap. And we're going to get the win. That's what I'm talking about. 21 health left, that's the importance of spells. If he would have any spell whatsoever, they would have been able to pull it off. I don't think they had a spell. They did. Whatever, it doesn't matter. So we get a win there. And at the end of the day, we only lost one tower. So, 8-0, only two towers down. Let's go ahead and get, hopefully, the final double go 9-0. and That would be really, really impressive. And I love the start here with the golem. Chances are... They're not going to have a card that's going to be able to kill the golem. I'm going to let those spear goblins get the damage off. Um, can't let the art, uh, hog rider because that will take out about 1200 health. So I'll let them get the two hits off there. Which I am perfectly fine with the witch. And I'm perfectly fine with the dark prince. I think mini P.E.K.K.A. should be able to take off the dark prince. Um, if not, it will be pretty close. All I'm going to do is bring the dark prince over. And then right there, the... Which should be able to go down. Yeah, which should be able to go down with the explosion of the golem. So we're in really good shape right now. Let's go ahead. Um, let's go back here. Let's use a zap. What I'll do is just draw out all the skeletons. Or the barb. Don't hit my witch. Oh, you hit the witch. No. Okay. Either way, so no big deal. So we have a slight lead on the left tower, about a thousand. And he has me about, about 200 on the other side. Let's go ahead right here. What I'm going to do is uh, just fireball. But I kind of want the musketeer to launch towards my mini mega minion. Just like... Oh, I almost pulled it off. Okay, so um, we're still looking really good. We have a pretty decent lead. That'll be it for the wizard. On that side. So I just got to prep for whatever else comes at me have the furnace in cycle let's just go ahead with the ice golem that'll take uh two hits off and i'm gonna let him chip i really don't have much of a choice i don't want to put in for elixir for really no big deal gonna sit back put another furnace put some pressure on the left side force him to play something there you go and then right here this is actually a pretty decent move uh because i'm gonna go right here with the electro wizard and then this is going to be toast. So now I got to be careful because I have a pretty strong push here and one scarm can take me out. But with the baby dragon, it's not going to be so easy. And the mini P.E.K.K.A. locks on. Did they lag out? I think they lagged out. The mini P.E.K.K.A. locks on and that's going to be tower done. I think they lagged out. Something happened. Uh, whatever. Doesn't matter. Maybe they just gave up. Either way, that's going to be GG. Good game. Well played. 9-0, guys. That's 
what I am talking about. 9 and 0. Oh, two towers down in 9 matches, guys. Two towers, that's it. I only gave up two crowns the entire challenge. This deck is insane. 9 and 0. Oh, let me go ahead and take a screenshot of that real quick because that is pretty impressive. Uh, I think so. And hopefully all of you can use this deck and have just as much success as I had. Let's go Lightning Chest. Just looking for some decent epics, honestly. Um, balloons. Um, you know what? That's fine with me. Balloons are always easy to trade. Pretty popular card. Let's open up the chest. See if we get anything in here. Uh, we got an epic. Guards. Okay, so we got an epic. So not bad. But that's going to be it. Um, oh, we can't try out the deck. So hopefully you guys can go back in the video try out the deck. Um, just to make sure you use a lot of spells. Um, try to use my deck exactly how I had it. Maybe change up a couple little things, but don't change up too much because the synergy was just amazing. So that's going to be it for my video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check my other Clash Royale and Brawl Stars videos for great content. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.